Hello, my name is Mary Akomo Boateng, On Point Education Founder. I'm here to talk to you a little bit about cleanup initiative that we're doing in Ghana this December 2019. The goal is to enter 2020 clean as Ghanaians. So 2020 clean as Ghanaians. And we are raising funds here in Toronto to be able to take few youth who have taken on the initiative to really de de dedicate their Christmas time to serve, or I should say service learning opportunity, going to Ghana to work with Ghanaians in Ghana in cleaning up Ghana. Um, and so we have, we're, I'm excited to let you know, we have other organizations in Ghana who focuses on recycling, who focuses on sanitation, focuses on education, focuses on waste management, who have partnered with us to be able to do this initiative. We also have volunteers from various communities who are coming out to clean up. So it's not us, we are going to clean up, but we are initiating the cleanup and we're working together with the Ghanaians in Ghana to clean up. So what are some of the things that we need support in? We need garbage bins. Um, you'll be surprised to know that. And I mean, it's not even surprising. Every household, every household generates waste, generates garbage, generates trash in their houses. Um, but it should not be thrown anywhere and everywhere. Gar garbage or trash or waste, we call it, should be disposed in proper garbage bins. Um, throwing away garbage all over the places will not only dirty our surroundings, but will pollute the environment. It makes the place unhygienic. It causes bad order. Um, you go to places in Ghana and the smell that welcomes you is amazing. Um, but it, 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 it also encourages infestations of cockroaches, flies, and all kinds of insects. The ones I don't like is the mosquitoes. And this is all because of poor management of how we dispose garbages. So we need garbage bins. Garbage bins are necessary in our communities um, and it should be covered up to prevent all these infestations and also the orders and other things that are coming out to the environment which are unhygienic for us. Um, if garbage bins are placed in proper environment and I always say proper environments like areas where are we have a large group of people who congregate there it could be bus stop it could be the park um, and also other areas like around the schools even in our community our homes our marketplaces if we have garbage bins in these areas we will be able to manage some of these garbage challenges that we're faced with if we have with management working properly to pick up these garbages we won't have garbage sitting and piling up um, so we are hoping to be able to get garbage bins all across the areas we're going to be cleaning up and we're starting from Accra we're starting from Accra because Accra is a place that we all stop when we get to Ghana and so garbage bins we need we need people to collect those garbage bins so I'm excited to let you know that we have organizations who are very excited to work with us. And so we're encouraging you all to come out this coming Saturday, Saturday at 6 Kilburn Place um, in Etobicoke, Toronto. We are doing, we're raising funds to be able to support this cleanup initiative that we have coming up. We're also working with the Ghanaian communities in, in Ghana, the, the the government system as well to be able to create a process which will be able to sustain what we are doing. Um, we hope that this will be a start of many great things to come. Thank you and hope to see you on Saturday at 6 Kilburn Place at 5 o'clock p.m. See you. Bye.